welcome to Super Profit Club. Today, I am going to take you through the difference between fundamental and technical analysis. Our traders, especially the beginners, the fundamental analysis, technical analysis, when to use it and when not to use it. So uh, be with me on this journey. Uh, my name is Sumit Gupta and I've been trading in the stock market for more than about 18 years now. And uh, I founded Super Profit Club with a mission to help one lakh traders become financially free and live the freedom lifestyle. We bring all these videos learning and educational purposes only. Uh, there's no intent of giving you any trading or investment advice. So whenever you uh, take any trade, uh, use your discretion, use your judgment, use your analysis and don't solely rely on this. Uh, however, I believe that whatever I share uh, in, in these videos can be really helpful for you learning the swing trading techniques and you can implement in your swing trading to trade profitably and if you like uh, this video just like uh, subscribe and share and keep coming back for, for more videos share it with your friends uh, and uh, family uh, or somebody who wants to learn it whom you think uh, could benefit from it uh, and let's jump into this uh, when i also started in uh, the swing trading uh, i was also confused at you know what is fundamental analysis what is technical analysis uh, i thought you know technical analysis is a very difficult uh, thing to do uh, and then I learned it. Once I learned it, it became very, very uh, easy for me. In this video, I'm going to take you through the key differences between the fundamental analysis and uh, uh, those. Uh, I've created a very brief uh, uh, slides for these, uh, which I'll take you through. Uh, so let me share my screen with you. Uh, what are the differences between fundamental analysis and technical analysis? The first one is that the fundamental analysis is based more to do with the financial statements of the company. So we analyze the past performance of the company analysis. Okay, uh, means uh, what are the kind of profits the company has earned? What are the kind of dividends it has declared in the past? What is the history of promoter? How long the company has been in uh, the business? What kind of business the company is in? So all those are part of the uh, fundamental analysis, right? Which is past performance, how the company did. Okay, all we look at is, is the study of past price movements. So whether the company made a loss last year or three years ago, or it has been consistently making profits for last 10 years, 20 years, how the price has moved over last uh, few years, few months, few days, uh, that is what we are concerned with Okay, in the technical analysis. We are not so much concerned with the past performance of the company. Obviously, uh, we want to know a little bit of history about the promoters and the company's business. So, because that will tell us uh, which industry does it operate in, uh, and also to ensure okay, that yes, uh, th uh, this is not a penny stock. Uh, so that's the that's the only thing. Otherwise, we are not so much concerned about anything else which a fundamental analysis works on. The second difference is that in the fundamental analysis, what do we analyze or what do we study is financial statements. Now, what are these financial statements? These financial statements could be a balance sheet, a profit and loss account, uh, a cash flow statement. So these are the, uh, these financial statements are studied, uh, various ratio analysis is done. So for doing a fundamental analysis, you should be able to read a balance sheet, a financial, uh, you know, cash flow statement or a profit and loss account, right? And also the notes and usually the financial statements runs in uh, roughly uh, hundreds of pages, right? Uh, in, in every uh, company, right? And you need to be, have financial uh, knowledge as well to understand those financial statements. When it comes to technical analysis, you don't need anything. You just need the charts. Only the charts are analyzed. So you look at the charts, what are the price movement happening? What is the support level? What is the resistance level? So you don't need to be an accountant or, or a financial person for this. Technical analysis, it is not the computer analysis or the technology. Based on technical points, we do not uh, look at the financial statements for the technical analysis only charts are analyzed. In the fundamental analysis, we look at the future prospects of the company. Its revenue is going to increase, new products market, you know, whether the company will be in a, a position to uh, give a uh, dividend or not. Technical analysis, we only look at the share price movement. Quick uh, uh, price movement means what is happening. We use a daily bar chart, so we are more concerned with how the price has moved. We also look at whether it is near a support or resistance level. Uh, swing trading, you can trade short as well as long. Short means when you are uh, selling. So if you expect the share price to fall, 
you sell first. Uh, long trading is when you buy first. So that is only when it is going up, right? So you just look at the share price movement, the prospects of the company. The fourth difference is the competitor and, and industry analysis. Why is that important? That's why a competitor analysis is done. Industry analysis is done. Let's say if the industry is really doing good and fast, then this company's prospects also improve. Industry analysis is also if the industry is expected to stagnate or you know, we take that, right? So we, we have to look at competitor analysis as well as industry analysis, okay? Technical analysis is we only look at the chart patterns okay when a downswing is happening uh, even if the company is doing very well the share price might be going down so all we are concerned in the technical analysis is the uh, the price movement and the the chart patterns that it is forming uh, based on those price movements okay we do not look at competitor industry etc and uh, that's how we do it okay the, in the fundamental analysis the information can be outdated something which was relevant five years ago or even six months ago may not be relevant any longer uh, even you know information of three days ago could be outdated However, when we come to the technical analysis, the information never ever gets uh, outdated. The reason simply being that the more data of the price that we have, the more historical data that we gather on price movement, that is you know always relevant for us and it never becomes outdated. So that is the uh, difference between the technical analysis and uh, the fundamental analysis, right? I hope you understand this now. And uh, now next time when I... Discussion happens whenever uh, you know, think about the fundamental analysis and technical analysis. You are better placed in a situation, uh, in a position wherein you understand what do these mean, and you can accordingly use this information in your trading. Okay, now which one is more important? Uh, both are equally important, uh, depending on what your horizon is. Now, if you are going for an investment, fundamental analysis becomes more important. If you are going for trading then technical anal uh, analysis is more important. I recommend that you only focus on technical analysis. Yes, if you have any fundamental information available to support your technical analysis, that's good. However, uh, the usage is different for both. Uh, so accordingly, take your pick, which one do you need? And uh, use the right tools, as I said, uh, you know, in other videos, uh, having the right tool and using that uh, at the right time is the key skill that you need. Uh, to succeed in anything that you do okay so i wish you all the best and if you like this video just like uh, click on the like button uh, subscribe and uh, share it with your uh, family friends or anybody who wants to have it uh, or uh, needs this information keep coming back for more the uh, learning videos and uh, if you want to uh, know more and learn more about swing trading join one of my webinars the link to which is given in the description below and uh, if you want to uh, uh, join our uh, community of Super Profit Club, uh, where we, which is a community of like-minded traders, you can click on the link below to join one of our programs. And uh, I will look forward to have you at one of my webinars or in the Super Profit Club community. I wish you all the best, more profits to you, and uh, have a great day.